Dartmouth tonight, Rhode Island's recovery from the historic floods. If your property was damaged by floodwaters, you could be eligible for help from the IRS. Today, Senator Jack Reed held a forum in Warwick to discuss how to help local flood victims get relief on their taxes. Eyewitness News reporter T.J. Del Santo joins us live with details from the Pinpoint Weather Yard. Even if you have already filed your taxes for 2009, you can always amend your return. And if you had losses due to the flooding, you almost certainly will want to amend it. While many are still drying out after the disastrous flooding, Senator Jack Reed met with accountants and IRS officials to discuss what people should know about their taxes. Working with the uh, public accountants in Rhode Island, we hope we can inform everyone so that our taxpayers get the full benefit of these advantages. And the advantages are many. You know we've extended the filing deadline to May 11th. May 11th is the new April 15th for Rhode Islanders, and you can use your 2010 flooding losses on your 2009 tax return. You do not need to have been impacted by the flooding. So you can be like many of us who are completely dry. All those provisions apply to us also. The May 11th deadline applies to anyone who has a business, property, records, or even just an accountant in Rhode Island. But perhaps the biggest tax advantage is how you can put the losses on your return. All taxpayers, not just those itemizing, um, can claim casualty loss deductions. What does that mean? Even if you don't own a home and you rent, you can claim your disaster losses on your 2009 return. For instance, if your adjusted gross income is $80,000 and you had $20,000 in disaster losses, your taxable income for 2009 would only be $60,000. There is legislation in the works which could allow these disaster losses to be used in 2010 instead of 2009. And there could be advantages to waiting until next year. IRS officials encourage everyone to watch that legislation closely. Now, of course, we advise you to check with your tax professional for more information. If you'd like more information on some of these tax advantages, you can always go to our website, WPRI.com. Reporting live from the Pinpoint Doppler 12 Weather Yard, I'm T.J. Del Santo, Eyewitness News.